All right, motherfuckers, we back. GTS on that dress. Let's get back into it. Peace. I've got everything you need, lone traveler. It's in the mothership. Back there. <laughs> Thanks, man. Look, here go your paper. Ah, the karmic circle closes. All is as it should be. Back to the egg. Ooh. Damn, man, there must be two tons of that stuff back there. Three. Rama. What the fuck's that noise? Hey, that sound like a chop. Oh, man, narcs, you fucking rat. Dude, don't put that on me. You the one deal with Ten Penny. What's all this? Calm, brother. Panic paves the way to bad karma. Man, we gotta torch those fields. I only hope Kaya can forgive us. All that good, all that good gas. Go. Right wing assholes. Oh, I don't feel too good. It's a crying shame, ain't it? No, I mean, I think I'm gonna black out. Fight the ocean and you will drown, brother. Girl, man, we'll take the mothership and get our shit out of here. Go get her fired up. I'll finish burning and I'll follow you. Oh, my boy CJ off that gas. Yeah. Holy motherfucker! Where'd you get that? 
loaded in a bale of tie sticks. Shame, really. We're gonna make it into a lamp. This boy said he he was got he had an RPG that he was gonna save for a rainy day. I must die from it. What you pull over for? You better drive. I haven't driven in 15 years. You was doing all right? Yeah. Then the fear hit me. Now I'm rolling a number to call me. Shit! I better call Caesar. Hey, Caesar, no time to talk, man. I'm on my way to San Fierro, okay? I'll meet you and Kendall at that garage I wanted the races. I'll let y'all later. Hey, this thing go any faster? Man, we got three tons of grass on board. The engine block is held together with a macrame hammock, and it's running on 15-year-old cooking oil. Shit, can you shoot? Shoot, I'm a hippie. The only thing I've shot is acid. I heard about this dude snorted it once. Thought his nose was a kangaroo and the moon was a dog. Woo! Ah oh, man, we all the way fucked up. Jesus, we screwed. When'd you get this? 1967. How you get around if you don't drop? I have an astral goat called Herbie. She's faster than most. But getting old. Yeah, whatever, man. You talking shit. What's with all aluminum for you, man? Protection from mind control, dude. Mind control? Induction of images, sound or emotion using microwave radiation. Do you know how many government satellites are watching any citizen at any moment? No. 23. Do you know how many religious relics are kept at the Pentagon? No, I don't. 23. Do you see a pattern emerging here, man? Man, I'm seeing patterns all over the place. Get that smoke out my face. Now we back to San Fierro again. There she is, brother. San Fierro, city of psychedelic wonders. Man, I can't believe I ain't been here before. There ain't a better place to escape the man, man. Okay, Mr. San Fierro, where's the spot at? It's in Doherty, on the east side of Fierro, between Garcia and Easter Basin. Hey, you want to hit on this? A little temple chair is in a cocktail with some Nepalese munga munga. Put that thing out, man. I can't see. Well, well, brother, it's good. This is the place. Whoa, Jesus, dude. Looks like you've been fed a bummer. Motherfucker! That mute asshole, that fucking snake without a tongue, gave me this shithole instead of a pink slip. I must be the biggest fucking idiot in the whole fucking world. Holmes, take it easy. At least we're alive. Girl, friend, fellow traveler, relax, man. You're really killing my fucking vibe here. Well, I'm sorry I'm fucking up your vibe, old man, but I can't wait to get my hands on that mute and your bitch ass cousin. My cousin? You're gonna diss my familia? My bad, man. I'm just pissed for all of us. I mean, look, we in a strange place. We got shit to our name, and for once, I try to make something work this garage, and it ain't even a garage. Then make it into a garage. Oh, that's a great idea, sis. Won't you shut up? You know what, Carl? You are a fucking idiot. Your whole life you wanted something for nothing. Now you've got something and you don't know what to do with it. We'll make it good enough. We'll help, right? We got your back, CJ. Come on, stop tripping, man. Both of you. Whoa, man, the energy here is fantastic. Oh. Yeah, uh, all right. But how am I find some good mechanics to work up in here, man? I know a few guys. Come with me, friend. They're good people, I swear it. 
Oh, man, I'm about to ride with this fool again. Come on, man. There's these two guys I know. Used to work on marine engines. Till the mob bought their business over in Vice. Now they try and make ends meet by taking any old job. They're a little bit dull by their habit. But the smoke don't get in the way of their skills with an engine. We'll pick up Jethro first. Last I heard, he was working at a garage over in East Basin. Man, why, why Kendall look like a name could be Shaquita? Hey, man, how you meet these dudes anyway? I met them I... at the 89 Pierre Lovin. Yeah. I said, Parent. You know how it is, man. Feel the tents, crazy ass music, a quart of mescaline vodka, polar bears. Polar bears? Yeah, go figure. But they were funny guys, man. Great sense of humor. This here's Vietnamese gang territory. Dang boys, shining razors, butterfly children. Watch yourself, dude. These cats are real serious. Hey, Jethro. Hop in, man. I've landed you a real job. Hey there, Truth, dude. Oh, man. Do, do I owe you? Cause I swear I paid for that weed, dude. No, man, we're good. I think. Jethro, Carl. Carl, Jethro. What's up, man? Can we swing by the hospital? It's over in Santa Flora District. West of here. Yeah. You sick? No. The government is. But that's a long story. So, you know, like, what's the deal, dudes? I'm opening the garage in Doherty by the waste ground. You know, car mods, low rocks, all that shit. Damn. Polar bear shit in the woods. No, but they've been known to shit in the liquor tent. If I remember it right. Yeah, that was like so far gone. Yeah. What's up where everybody just shitting in the woods? CJ asked him to do the poke shit in the woods. He asked him to do the polar bear shit in the woods. Bro, he just ate like... Not that long, like what, about like a mission or two ago. A couple missions ago. Anyway, nothing. Oh, don't look. Cover your faces. Think about a yellow rubber duck. You tripping again? Shh. Okay, I've seen enough. Let's go see if we can find Wayne. He's working a hot dog van at the tram terminal in Kings. Come on, dude. What's all that about? You don't want to know. Why? Do you know what a subdermal neurophone is? A what? Exactly. Sometimes it's best to stay in the dark, kid. Dude, Dwayne, man, how's the hot dog business? It's totally shit. Why? What's happening? Uh, my friend Carl here is opening a chop shop. Jethro's in. How about you? Uh, yeah, cool, man. Uh, I've got, like, some shit to take care of first, though. So, uh, you tell me where you guys are gonna be at, and I'll meet you dudes there. The garage is on the waste grounds in Doherty. I'll see y'all later. Okay, next stop, cop station downtown. What? Watch your mind. Why? If I told you, the likelihood is you'd get a probe up your ass within a month. Like, listen to the man, dude. He's real serious about that shit. Well, okay. But you're starting to freak me out with all that spaceship, man. Yeah, he's just losing fat like that. Like, every two, three seconds, he's just losing fat.
Okay, you know the drill. Don't look interested in anything. Picture a pink golf ball in your mind. Okay, we're good to go. Where to next, spacehead? There's an electronics guy I've had dealings with. Goes by the name of Zero. He could fix a supercomputer with a paperclip. He's got his own shop, but he's always ready to help fellow travelers along the path. Let's go introduce you to him. Look, what's going on, True? Look, what's going on, True? Who was him do? Don't go there, man. Listen to Jethro. Now, what if I told you we never went to the moon? JFK lives in Scotland with Janis Joplin. And the only reason we've been in the Cold War for the last 45 years was because snake-headed aliens run the oil business. I think you popped another micro dot. Good. Keep it that way. There's a on my <laughs> Sign my boy Carl on woke, man. Berkeley, this is stalking. Oh, hey, truth. Get in. I'll fill you in as we drive. Home, James. Carl, zero. Zero, Carl. What's up? Carl here is opening a garage around the corner. I told him you're the man to speak to when it comes to electronics. <laughs> Actually, I'm the only man to speak to. <laughs> Grade A tip top genius. That's me. You should drop by the shop sometime. See some of my shit, bro. I'll do that. Okay, we here. A week of hard work, and we'll transform this place. Hey, Caesar, come over here. What's up, B? Caesar, this Jethro, Dwayne, and Zero. Hey, man, dude. Salutations, my sibling. Orale, let's get to work. Hey, hey, Carl, look, I think I found a way for us to get paid. I ain't going to no college to study no account. No, idiot, property. Decorating <laughs> ain't exactly my thing either. No, property development. Look, you buy a dump like this, fix it up, and sell it. Or better yet, you turn the property into a business. The snowball gets bigger. I don't know, sis. This all sound big time to me. Look, Carl, this place is going to get on its feet. And when it does, we are going to have money. If you want to make something of yourself, you got to let your money work for you. Look. I wouldn't even know where to start. Look, you two concentrate on the garage and let me work the property thing, okay? Yeah, that's my baby girl right there, Holmes. <laughs> Man, you chose her. I'm stuck with her. <laughs> Come on, bro. His stomach really growling like don't. Easy there, tiger. Yeah, what? Sorry, Carl, are you busy? Zero? Nah, man, good to hear from you. What's up? Disaster. My landlord is selling the shop. I'll have nowhere to live and no safe haven from Berkeley. Ah, oh, I'm looking to invest in some property at the moment. Maybe I'll swing by. Hey, bro, you ain't have to just drip that motherfucker like that on me. Like this, uh, what's his name? Hot dog, hot dog van right here. Wow, 
What does Sir desire? Slurp my burger, sir. What do you Excuse think of me? these sneaks? Please enjoy your meal. Hope we see you again, sir. Do come back again. Use your eyes. Maybe you should work out a bit more. This should work out a little bit more. Oh. This a robbery. Don't make it a murder. So dang, she just gonna play me like that? She ain't gonna. A man should be like a bull seal. I don't know which one should I get. You want to get your head ripped off? Help me out with a sip, homie. You make me forget my woes, girl. Easy, baby. I'll call the lecture. So you wish to become a warrior? Dragons! Sorry. Absorb with the eyes, young student, and you will learn. Strike like an atomic cobra! Nothing clever here, just kick them while they're down. Become the avalanche and bury your opponent! All right. Well, these no moves. Let's see. Let's use them. I think you can take me on, punk. Trust me, I don't give a shit. Hit me then, homeboy. Give me your best shot. Let's go, bitch. Oh, my God, CJ. Hello? 
Carl, it's Zero. Oh, uh, hi, Z. You wasn't around when I signed the deeds. Yes, I know. I was on a dangerous reconnaissance mission. Deep into enemy territory. Uh, yeah, right, sure, whatever you say. I should come through and have a look at the business, you know? Oh, of course, of course. I'll have to tidy up a bit. This place is such a mess. Don't worry about it. I'll drop in soon. Pop your brakes! I've got one time on my ass. I might as well do the zero on this one first. Hey, what up, Z? Nothing is up, Carl, apart from my blood pressure and the imminent collapse of my hopes and dreams. Why? As usual, the forces of darkness have triumphed over good. Life is nothing but misery, briefly interspersed with agony. Homie, what you own? Whatever it is, you need to reduce the dosage. Excuse me, but I never take drugs. We all know drugs are for losers and or sex maniacs. And right now, sex is the last thing on my mind. Thank God for that. Berkeley is back. Oh, Berkeley. Yes. Who the fuck is Berkeley? Oh, just a man I once beat in fair competition. A man literally obsessed with revenge. <laughs> oh, you put hands on him? No, please. <laughs> I never initiate violence. Oh, I know. You knocked his bitch. Uh, no. I won the prize in the science fair. <laughs> First prize, that is. And now you want to pop you? <laughs> no. And they say gangbangers is petty as small-minded. Hey, what's that bleeping sound? That's him. We shall fight to the end. Berkeley's launched a full-scale attack. This is insanity! All batteries commence fire! He's going for my transmitters. If he takes them out, I'll never be able to launch a counterattack. No problem, man, but they're only toys. They're not toys. They're just smaller. CJ, bogey's at 12 o'clock.
the hell is it, man? To the last transmitter. You've got to stop those planes, Carl. As long as we have opposable thumbs, we will fight you. Well done, Carl. Now leave. I must prepare for the battles ahead. Never have so few owed so many. Too little three... No, that's not it. What is it? We will fight him on the beaches. Well, rooftops. Yeah, I might as well do another one. Hey, Z, where you at? Go away, Carl. I'm, I'm very, very busy back here. Top, top secret stuff, not for your eyes. Too sensitive. Come on, homie, where are you? I said go away, Carl. I don't need any friends today. Thank you. <laughs> Man, them some pretty strong draws. Yes, my hero. Carl, he came back and humiliated me. I shall probably turn to prostitution now. Where I will be found dead and broken. I am a 28 year old man whose landlord just helped him down from a hook from which I had been hanging from my underwear, contemplating my inadequacy for nearly two hours. Ow! My crack. Look, you gotta get even, homie. What kind of weapons you got? Uh, I've got a prototype of a miniature plane. Huh, <laughs> well, with that plane, we gonna go humiliate Burke. Mm. Okay, cool. Man, this is ridiculous. That went right up my cr Berkeley has his sycophantic lackeys do all his deliveries. Well, we shall hit him where it hurts the most. Bring his mail order model business to its knees. Launch the Red uh -oh. Baron. That's why I stopped there last time.
Oh my god, the flying on here is trash. Come on, bro. Why is it so crash on her to fly? Like, the stand there, it, it takes so much.
flying and spill on her is trash. Oh, the fucking stirring on this is so trash. Bro, I turned this. Oh my fuck. Bro, 
turn, 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 turn. Oh my fucking god, bro, this shit. Bro, like, why does it take so much for this? My fucking like, bro. Why does it take so much for this lip? This lip. Bro, I just need one more, bro. I just, I can't have this. It can't fly straight to save his life. Turn, I'm hitting, I'm hitting the button. Why did we not touch these controls, dog? I still put like I'm playing the PS2 version. These controls is trash. You just really take Nah dog. Yeah, he gonna have to see if he don't turn, he gonna have to see me. He fucking turn. No. Why is the control so hard to fly a lip plane? It should not be this hard to fly. Oh my fucking god, bro. Bro, this it, it should not be this hard, bro. Shut up, Zero. So if I hold both of them, it should go straight, right? Now get her back home in one piece before she runs out of fuel. Oh, that... Tell me like 50 minutes.
Well, we gotta get this. I do not want to play this mission again, dog. Thank you. Thank you. Smells like victory. Smells like I ain't playing that. I'm glad I got to play you guys' mission. Now I'm in the video right here, man. Like the video if you like the video. And I'm out. Peace.